Buddy, I promised you a video and here it is. I already got over $130 in gold that I've earned and over $1,300 in cash. These are the shops that are around the square and Jen and I have really enjoyed being here and going to them. Got a lot of souvenirs I'm excited about sharing with you when I get back. This place is for real. There are two gold mines here in town. We took part of the afternoon and toured the countryside. The mine tour was really great because not only do you get to see the mine, but you get a pan for gold, and the gold that you find, you get a keep. And very quick, 15,000 heard about it. So here, we got the first major gold rush in U.S. history. Now, over here is a vein of quartz. In the quartz, you can see some shiny stuff. And that shiny stuff is the fool's gold. But I guarantee there's one thing on this war card you will not find on any war card in the world. They got the gold, just paid too much for it. So that's why we can't mine today. Because of that iron problem, the mines in the Dahlonega Belt are the most expensive in the world to operate. I believe this drill was first designed in 1888. The guy's name that done it was Edward Alice. He had the uh, Edward P. Alice company. One thing I've come to appreciate in all of this though, is when you go through the mine and you see what they had to do to get that gold, what we have to do to get the gold on the internet is a whole lot easier than that. So I'm looking forward to getting back there with you. If any of you guys want to, you can qualify for that $2,500 fast start.